Andrew Travers, and I'm here to share with you some an idea called uh, two versions of the same thing, or the same piece. Right now I'll start with pieces, and then I have some other ideas to, to share with you tonight. Um, so, for for all students that are, are, are working on mastering their instruments, and going back to some, some old pieces sometimes to, to review them and, and bring the level up, or as my uh, one of my my colleagues, uh, Pam Devonport, says upgrade the piece to the next level. Uh, we can take a piece and change it from, uh, from one kind of sound to another. Uh, here's what I'm talking about. So there's this sound. And then there's this sound. It's actually used in a very famous piece uh, in a movie about space called 2001. opposite way is kind of interesting too. And that's the difference between major and minor. This is major. All of those were major chords. Here's minor chords. from uh, say book one Suzuki or an early piece and change a couple of notes to make it major or minor. Well here's what Twinkle Twinkle Little Star might sound like. Scared. So, so see if you can catch this. the original cellist's favorite song. pieces. Really, it's the same piece. So I encourage you to, to see if you can change a note in a piece. Sometimes it doesn't even have to be for a key. Like, what if we took... That's funny, isn't it? Thing, uh, not yet. 
was that we may be needing to play in an environment where we have to be a little softer. And you have to, you can use something called a mute. Now, if you don't already have one of these, and there's no music stores open near you, there's a lot of online companies that'll, that'll certainly sell them to you. This made out of rubber is my favorite version. A lot of people have their own favorites. Here's the sound on. The sound off. It doesn't mute a lot. It's not a... You can still play loud with that thing. So let's see, what else can we do? What do we have around the house that might be helpful? They fit nice between the strings here, too. Looks funny, but looks aren't important because you got, you got some people that need the rest. Or maybe you are in an apartment. I'm going to use it all here. Make sure they're not touching any of the strings down there. Make room for one more. There we go. That doesn't sound good at all. things you can do. But I tell you what, here's a fun experiment to end with today. Especially if you've got some small hands. Tell them to wash their hands first and then have small hands cover up your F holes. One hand there, one hand there, and then have them keep their hands out of the way so your bow can still work. And try playing something with the, them covered up. And then at a random point while you're playing, have them take the hands off see how much volume this little instrument can make. Well, that's my little video today for two different pieces, two different versions, two different ways to think about it. You know, the minor way can sometimes feel very, very sad and very dark. <laughs> perspectives these days. We can hear a few things or think a few things and we can feel very down and very very all kinds of things that are that are that are down feeling emotions. The ones that he are heavy. We can change one little thing about it and hopefully switch our perspective and feel better despite it all. Kind of like <laughs> Keep practicing. I hope you're well. And uh, reach out if you need anything. I love you guys.